episode 27. They're here, Brendan Xander. How are we doing, buddy? How are you, folks? Facts. I just bought a toy at Target. He's here for oh, it. Yeah. Brendan's oh, here for the podcast. Shit. How much did this cost you? It was thirty-five dollars. Thirty-five dollars. Thirty-five. Yeah, that's, oh, that's thirty-five dollars. This is thirty-five dollars worth. Yeah. All right, hang on. Let's. Recording. Next. When I turn red, say something. I'll mix it into a song. Here we go. Xander is fat. Me, 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 me. Because I didn't really want to. It, Do just, it. it wasn't my This vibe. is more of an intellectual podcast, Thomas, rather than a I physical podcast. I, I understand tradition. I understand tradition. And then you, you have to meet him. Spank his belly. You gotta work for it, though. Wait, how about we just dance? Clap. Meet Xander. Clap. Fat. 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 I'm gonna unplug that goddamn. If you moan into it, it's really funny. Well, that's actually a funny idea. Recording, remix. When I turn red, say something, and I'll mix it in. I don't want to do it on camera. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that's terrible. You need to get turned off. I'm just going to hold on to him. Well, should we name it? You are going to turn what me. should we name it? Dan Schneider. Right Schneider. Right Schneider. Sh Schneider. This is this is Schneider. Okay. Schneider only says the truth. Though. Yeah. Hot Schneider. tubs with little kitties. Not, not, not good. Nice not, things. not good stuff. Very no. and very fat. Okay, we, we should just cut this whole part from the episode. Well, I can do whatever I want. Okay, we've already decided <laughs> this little demon thing that cost thirty five dollars. This thing's Schneider because it's a kid's toy. So yeah, you guys can <laughs> do your own research. with kids. Yep, for real. Should we meet him? <laughs> I mean... Me? No, please. I can make exceptions. I feel like we, we should. I, I would rather, you know. I'd rather we didn't. Please don't. I, I have a drink. Don't do it. No, I see the fingers. I would really prefer if you didn't. If, <laughs> if you meet me, I'm gonna leave. That's, that's my concession. Is if you meet me, I'm gonna leave. I'm not joking. It's me time. I don't, don't hey, well, meet me. Do not meet me. If he's you meet, gonna leave. If you meet me, I'm gonna leave. Don't, don't, don't respect don't his wishes. I'm happy to do an episode, just don't meet me. This is two fucking psychos with a normal person. I, I respect like this. Well, let's show. move on to movies. You like movies, right? Like, I, what are you making this year? I'm making a movie about... You're making K-Pasa Day Way. I'm making K-Pasa Day Way right now. It's my second appearance. Pretty, but, pretty exciting. I've only been invited on twice. Like, I mean... We've tried. Is... I keep forgetting to call you. Like, yeah, I... Well, we've called you several times. So. Well, you only ever call me when I'm not in town. And I have told you... Hey, it's of... still an invitation, well, though. Well, here's the thing, though. is because I've been like, hey, when are you guys film like, doing another episode? Like, at, like, tell me now and I can try to be there. And you guys are like, well, um, I don't know. Maybe we'll do it. I don't know. We'll call you. And then, like, three weeks will go by, and then you'll call me when I'm in the middle of, you know, hanging out with somebody or, you know, I'm out of town or something, and you'll call me and you'll be like, hey, you free right now? Like, we're outside your house. Like, come do an episode with us. And it's mm -hmm. like, well, mm -hmm. I'm not at my house. I, I called you on Wednesday and didn't pick up. I left a message, too. You called me on Wednesday? I called you on Wednesday? I was in the bath, though. I think I called Wait, you back. Can we, did you left a voicemail in the bath, Did you leave though? a voicemail? I, I definitely left a voicemail. Did you leave a voicemail? <laughs> oh, my God. You did leave a voicemail. Oh, my God. Wednesday. Just let's turn this thing up. Oh my god, it's long. Oh, it's very long. That's, That's what she, she said. Anyway, I just wanted to call you. I know I was supposed to call you on Monday, but uh, stuff caught up to me and I was unable to, but today I can. I just wanted to ring you up. Um, <laughs> I believe we are going to be able to do a podcast um, this Sunday. I will find the date for you real quick. This Sunday. Got to do that. Like 2012. 24th. So, uh, yeah. Just let me know if you can. Uh, I'll put that on there. <laughs> you can hear the water. I, I'm touched that you think of me. I was watching Instagram Reels, and then some, like, um, you know the guy, the dad from Coraline? 
I guess the real like dad came up and I was like, oh, I gotta call Brendan. Oh, wait, I forgot that you guys so said I looked like the dad from Coraline. It's okay. You, you it looks like Chris Griffin. Griffin. You look. Wait, what's that? You um, do look like Chris Griffin. <laughs> if you put on the hat, can we just start from the top? Like is that? There is no there, top. There is no top. Okay. It's like it's like a trough. You know, it's uh, just food and fat laying yeah, there. Yeah, like know? a buffet. Oh, you can he know. would know about that. Yeah. I've actually never been to a buffet. You never been to a buffet? <laughs> That's a lie. I've been to a buffet. Yeah, that's... not not like I knew that was fat a lie. people lie like buffets, but like the the one at uh, Wegmans foreclosed. But then like the wings and fries and stuff into that one. Yeah, that's a buffet. That's the only like, buffet I've ever been to. That's a buffet. Really like I don't what's the it's... difference between like a buffet and a fat person buffet? Like Golden Corral. I've never been to Golden that's Corral. Is that neither have I? Is that a fat person thing? Yeah. Like, I mean, it's called Golden Corral, so I would believe it's. Well, Golden Corral just kind of. It's it's like for cows. So corrals like yeah, cows. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're, they're, they're corralling the big fat white right. people. We, me and Xander went to the grocery went to my girlfriend's grocery store where she works, of course. For oh my, wow! Yeah, I'm done. Holy fuck! Me, me, me. But yeah, me and Xander uh, went to my girlfriend's grocery store to visit her while she was working, yeah. and we bumped into a teacher, and she he told Xander he had to lose some weight and point, and pointed at his belly. It was quite. Is this, is this a teacher who works at the high school, Mr. Oh. Oh. He, he touches my bed, he goes, oh, you're gonna need to lose a little bit of their son before you ship. <laughs> I'm like, fuck you! Yeah. Can I have my drink back? I don't know why he stole it from you. you uh, I was putting it to the side because I didn't want you to spend I know, it. you wanted to meet me, but like, it would mean a lot if I could have my drink. Because I am thirsty. You're thirsty? Thirsty boy. Can I get a sip? No. Do you think I'm made out of garbage? I'm made, actually, you know, do you no. know that every member on k Day Way, every host, is made out of 100% recycled material? We are very um, supportive of the planet. You so, produce so much content. Like, a, like a sports bra for planet Earth. You need a sports bra. I'm going to punch you in the balls, Zach. Dude, it, it's, it's huge, so you probably could hit it. If I punched you in the balls, I'd need a fucking telescope. <laughs> and by telescope, I mean microscope. <coughs> I'm glad you're here, Brendan. I'm glad I'm here. I like doing why, the why, why did you? Why do you agree to, become, to come to this place? Because it's fun to do. I think you guys are fun. We had a great ride over here. I'm yeah, I love right? you, Brendan. You're a great guy. I feel like, I, I feel like I'm like... But you know, you have like a strangled face. I feel like I'm a, Yeah, I've been told that I am... Yeah. I've been told that at some point in my life... I mean, I feel like somebody's gonna punch, punch me in the face. No, you look like the type of... You look like... Who's the Joker? Um... <laughs> Oh, Joaquin Phoenix. You do look like Joaquin Phoenix. Do I? Okay. Yes. You don't have that, like, fucked up shoulder thing, though. I don't always like, you had, like, a fucked up shoulder or something, because he was like, oh, eh. Yeah, I think it was just because You got the attitude, though. Thing. Sometimes, I remember during football season, you did get frustrated with me. Fuck and yeah. Xander sometimes. Shoot, what's that one guy he fucking shot in the head? Uh, he shot a lot of people. He shot, like, three. No, not. In the um, subway. Well, yeah, well, no, well, yeah, but the guy in the show. Oh, the fucking actor. Murray. Yeah. Murray. Well, yeah. Robert De Niro. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you shoot Robert De Niro in the face with a 38 revolver? Probably not. I feel like I would shake his hand and like want to talk to him about movies. Oh, You're dude. like Young Sheldon, you know? I'm I'm my Sheldon. calculations, bro. Oh, I, I've never, I'm not <laughs> smart like Young Sheldon. <laughs> well, I could kick Young Sheldon's ass in a fight, uh, to be what, clear. What about like... Like, um, that's that's some wild allegation. We should get the young Sheldon actor out right here. You bring young Sheldon here. First, I would talk to him because I'm not gonna immediately jump. What if I young Sheldon like was right in that corner and he says, "Fuck you! I'm gonna beat the shit out of you right now," and his hair is like all like waxed down. Yeah, and... I mean, I would want him to try. You know? Yeah, and he try. He's got one little hair spiking up, and he's running at you like. I want, I want, I want, I want, I want what do all you do? the beef with young Sheldon. Yo, young Sheldon. <laughs> young Sheldon. Sheldon. Pull up, pull up with the opps. Young pull Sheldon, up. you're going down. Brandon's gonna get you. Young Sheldon. I'm gonna meet you. Young Sheldon, you you will never be as cool as your older brother. What's his older brother's name? The fucking old kid. Sheldon. I don't know. <laughs> what, what's older brother Sheldon with the like the fucking hair? He like I can look yeah, it just up. me. Bro. He like he like me. bangs a thirty year old and they have a kid. Oh yeah, yeah, dude, yeah. Fuck him. He's fucking. Sick. I don't know the kid's name. Chris Griffin over that, here. That, that kid is sick. Sick. I would hang out. I would hang out with that kid. Like fuck I'm young real. Sheldon. I would want to be friends with his brother. Hanging a thirty year old dude to fucking like. He's a fucking goat. He's like seventeen and he's like yeah you know. He's got his fucking southern draw, and he's like, I like, that's, yeah, I like it. It kind of looks like, kind of like, like, no, like Australian. Australian. Yeah. Do you guys think he kind of looks like a young Theo Vaughn? I love Theo Vaughn. Uh, no, I, 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 yeah, I, I see that. I kind of see that, My girlfriend watches Young Sheldon, so I've had to suffer. You watch Young Sheldon? I have to. I have never actually sat through a full episode of Young Sheldon. <laughs> God bless you, dude. God bless you. I have seen clips. And honestly, I don't like. I don't. It's think a shit it, show. It's I, garbage. I don't think it's like the worst thing ever. Like I, I think it is. I can understand why people like it. I just watch it and I'm like, 
this is fun. This is like cute for like a minute. I just feel like sitcoms like that after like eight seasons. Like that's when I'm, I'm kind of like, like Friends. Like, have you seen Friends? I tried to get into Friends. It never really was for me. Like I yeah, like, it's kind of a mid show. Like I'll be honest, a lot of people are like everybody loves crazy Friends, Friends, and I get like I get that it's like quotable and it was fun in the '90s, yeah. but like I don't know. I feel like yeah. when, I feel like if you go back and watch it, it's like it's fine. I mean, I I think it's. it's it can be really funny. It can be. The only show I'll go back and watch is Star Wars: The Clone Wars. What, what do you watch like all the way through? For shows, um, Mike and Molly. No. What's that? <laughs> Meet. I watch. Uh, I don't really watch a lot of TV. When I do, you watch, watch the Star Wars stuff. Right? When it, when I watch TV, it's like stuff like that. Like I'll watch like hour long episodes of stuff. Stuff that's more like movies. Like that just gets my attention more. You know what? Um, Looking at you, Xander, you remind me of an old show. Uh, what was it? Um. The, there's, uh, they're on a, it's it's like animated. It was on Cartoon Network. They like survive um, so on an island. Total drama. Okay, campers. Total like, oh, yeah. For today's challenge, we're gonna meet Xander Bell. And like, it's fucking you. Your face just dropped when he said that. <laughs> dude, you like Owen from? No, 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 me, 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 no. We're gonna cup. milk this kid later, <laughs> dude. Dude, if they I'm gonna be milked dry to the bone by the time I'm done with you, Jeez. Brendan. Good lord. I. That was like that was like ape like when you just spat that <laughs> <out of laughs> fucking. I, I took a DNA test. Fucking King Kong. Let me tell you something. Here. DNA test. I don't. I you know? Did you song. know that um I'm actually in the top like twelve percent for Neanderthal DNA. That's no like, one's like a full one percent of true. Neanderthal DNA. I swear true. to fucking that's God. Like, no, twenty three me will tell you fuck. that look shit. Look at him. Look at his I'm brow. Not, look at this. I'm not fucking brow. lying to you. I'm in the top twelve percentile of You're people that have taken that test. Look at that shit, dude. He looks like he fucking lives in a cave. Fucking a cr- moist fucking, fucking cave. You're yeah, fucking he has to look at me like I'm a fucking zoo animal. Meat! 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 Do not do not take this the wrong way. Do not take this the wrong way. I will. Do not take. I will enter you. Please, please do not take this the wrong way. I'll protect you. Say it. Do not take this the wrong way. You know the fucking pig from Sing. Oh! No! I do not know the pig death from sentence. Sing. I do not. Pop the picture. Pig from Sing. Let's go. That's fucking a banger right there. It's not accuracy. It's not like it's not it's not your voice. It's just like your eyes and like the kind of complexion (laughs) of your skin and like your blonde hair. It just kind of like vaguely reminds me. Yep, you're getting raped. (laughs) Whenever I see a pig on Instagram, I put it on my story. You've probably seen it before, right? Uh, I haven't been on Instagram in like two months. But you've seen it before, right? Probably. Yeah, it's like a pig eating like ramen noodles. It tags me. I've seen that. So we got pig from Sing, Doctor Doofenshmirtz, and. Who'd you say? Grug from the Croods. Oh yeah, Grug from Croods. Put him up there. Ah, Perry the Platypus. Oink, oink. And my unexpected <laughs> pig. I mean. uh, mom picked me up and scared. I, you don't like getting meat. You don't like getting meat. Why Why do it? <laughs> it's it's a punishment for, uh... To, you know, prove your masculine, testosterone-fueled blood energy. But it's like, kind of like a dominance. It's like, you know how dogs, like, will fight, like, to be the alpha wolf of the pride? That's kind of like what I do with Xander, you know? He's the beta, and you're like the ultra beta. Well, I would say I'm I'm the just ultra beta. No, you didn't. I was was barely... (coughs) People saw earlier, that was was not even me trying. And I can edit it out, so I can be the only one that wins. Why am I the ultra beta? Because you're the smallest. And also the weakest. But I'm I'm the the strongest. I'm the smartest. I'm the leader. I'm the one you trust. Do you know what that's from? Because I do. Uh, What is it from? I forget. You don't know, because I'm smarter than you. I can... Just because you jerk off in front of the TV fucking 17 hours a day doesn't mean you're smarter than me, boy! Yeah! Okay. What's the square root of 64? Eight. Eight! Good, good. Okay, just making sure. Yeah, yeah cause he ate I've all the food in the fridge! Oh. All the food in the fridge! The fridge! Ah! The fridge! Make me, make me, make me, make me, make me! But I just need to meet Yeah! yeah. They're oh my god! Photos, oh my god! Xander smells like stinky. <laughs> Shut up, they're lies! He's beautiful! <laughs> I'm glad you're on this episode, Brendan, because it's hard to find people that want to be on this show. You're actually really brave. We paid for a lot of therapy because you were traumatized for the first time we tried to get you on. I have. 
Yeah, the code word is, uh, I think, thermostat. Oh, the code word is thermostat. You know what, Xander? I think we need to spice up our podcast. What do you mean, promise? I think we should bring back Bazinga Brendan. Bazinga Brendan? I fucking love that guy! And ever since, he's just been like... Oh, fuck! He, ever since, he's just been talking about, like, not wanting to be on the podcast. So I think the best course of action is to break into his house while he's asleep and get him on the podcast. Because that way, he'll have no choice. That's a great goddamn idea, Thomas. Oh, yeah. Me, me, me. Me, 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 me. Man, ah, it's been such a long day of watching movies and sounding like young Sheldon and looking like young Sheldon and uh, thinking about young Sheldon and just dreaming about young Sheldon and uh, what would it be? There he is. The Zynga boy. Oh, how far I have traveled. It's time to put you in the suitcase. Oh, I can't wait for Xander to put you in that suitcase, oh boy. At first. Yeah. You got him in there? You got him in there, boss? Oh, bastard. Oh, 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 Shut the fuck up! Uh, all right, uh, Xander, do you, want, do you want to do the honors of explaining the carousel the or carousel? shall I? What's the carousel? Dude, Thomas, so the carousel, dude. you have six slots to fill. Okay. And the, and the horses on your carousel will ride you, if you know what I mean. You have six slots to fill, and the one that gets the nut wins a vacation, which is called the sweepstakes. Six slots. It could be anything from a girl to a man to a jar of peanut butter. Nothing is off limits. Six I, slots. I feel right like in. this is something I shouldn't put on film. Thing okay, usually. so first first stop on the carousel is the Dune 2 popcorn bucket. Okay. <laughs> yeah! Um, I don't know what that is, but I'll put up an image. The Dune 2 popcorn bucket. Alright, that's one slot. That's the first stop Next. on the carousel. Uh, the second stop on the carousel is, you know, um, God, I'm gonna go to hell. I'm gonna go straight down to hell. Are you already on the podcast? Might as well keep going. Oh my god. You know how when a tree is growing, some, no, no, no. Let me go back. First stop, right? First stop on the carousel, Dune 2 popcorn bucket. Right. Second stop on the carousel, jar of peanut butter. It may be Skippy. I would go smooth Skippy. Smooth, I'm a, a chunky whichever, 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 one, whichever one the teal is. Chunky the teal one. Man. You know what I mean? The teal. That's Skippy. Would you, want yeah, chunks in, would you want chunks in it? No, smooth? no, smooth. You don't want chunky. Chunky God. Peter Pan. Chunkies. Well, Chunky's like what the peanut butter is on its period. Yeah. Uh, the, six. Six. six, 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 six we got, got two. Popcorn bucket, peanut butter. My third. It could be an animal too. I don't, I don't think I would do that. Uh, oh, so <laughs> in the movie, I would do probably um, Spruce from Trolls Band Together, the third Trolls movie. There's, there's a what the fuck. Spruce is like the the best troll, I think. Oh, she's a, like, oh, she's... no, it's a dude. Oh, it's okay. like a, it's like a fat, middle aged looking dude. Tom will find it. I think I might be looking at it up there. Fill it up, Brent. Fill it up, Brent. This, this, yeah. this has been a terrible, uh, terrible turn of events. <laughs> this is not what I should have. Curse account with Doug's grandma, dude. Oh! That's crazy. <laughs> Go to Alright. First, first spot on the carousel. Doing two popcorn bucket. Right, right, right. Second spot on the carousel. Bars, uh, a, 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 a jar skipping. Right, yeah, yeah. Uh, third spot on the carousel. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to give the third spot on the carousel. You know how when, you know, wet concrete, you know, like how, like you can, when you smack it, it's like solid. Mm, oh. I, that's, that's whiskey business, but okay. You can go for it. That's, that's what you want. You want wet concrete. You want wet concrete. No, I want 
the wet concrete mixer. The spinning thing. Oh, oh, I think I know what you're talking about. Concrete truck. Yeah, that's like also that's like the kind of that's like instead of subway surface, that's what I get now because I'm educated. Um yep. fourth spot, I would say the fish from Shark Tale, the girl one. Not not the main girl one, the the Angelina Jolie girl one. I, I appreciate that. The first spot. Dune two popcorn. Dune two popcorn. Yeah. Second spot. Jar of Skippy Peanut Butter. Those two are locks. Right, yeah. The third spot. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the concrete mixer. Yeah. I feel like, I feel like people are sleeping on the concrete mixer because the concrete is still wet. My fourth spot. Mike we, Dyson. No. <laughs> I, I let me speak. I want the Thanksgiving turkey. Alright, that's valid. Cooked. I want the cooked stuffing right out the oven. He's make he's gonna be the stuffing. Right, I, I would say ten minutes out of the oven, so it's still warm. A little bit of gravy, a lot, a lot of sausage helps. in there. Listen, gr gravy helps make it make it go down smoother. You know what I mean? Go in smoother. Uh, four, four is the third turkey. So four is the no, not a turkey. It has to be the Thanksgiving dinner <laughs> right. turkey. Like, Thanksgiving it, dinner it, turkey, it has not to, cold cuts. No, 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 it has to be the turkey the that Heinz every family. No, not mm -hmm. my, not my Xander's turkey. family. Not my, it has to be the turkey that everyone at Xander's family was getting. Like everybody <laughs> sits down. <laughs> Xander's the bird at the dinner. Everyone Xander. sits like everyone comes into the house after their Bums. after the backyard football game on Thanksgiving. Right, that's a thing. People will go play in the backyard. They go play the football. They come back in to eat their. Brandon delicious. just fucked the they turkey. Come, they come back in to eat their delicious Thanksgiving turkey, and there I am, laying next to it, smoking a cigarette. And there's just a, <laughs> in bed. There's just a, me laying, fucking ah, drip, right up the, at the roof, dripping the fucking, gravy from a, the turkey. A lit cigarette. The smell of gravy and turkey is just mixed into the aroma of bo. That would be so that turkey specifically, the Bell Thanksgiving family turkey. <laughs> nice, dude. That's number great. four. Fifth spot on the carousel is in Spokane, Washington. The letter O after the spo, Spokane. If you look at the word Spokane, mm -hmm. the O in the middle. I'm gonna have to look that up, but yeah, that is an acceptable. Um, we can take the O and put it on the carousel machine. That would be that would be a good one. I just think. Yeah. the budget is just really right. high for this stuff, but we can do it. You know how when you go to a gas station, sure, and you're you're pumping the gas, and you take the you take the nozzle out, and there's still some gas that drips, and you get that like aroma of sure. gasoline. I would want to fuck Kamala Harris. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I've said that before too. Wait, right. hey, actually, wait a minute. Who's gonna win the sweepstakes? Sweep, who wins? Who gets the nut? <laughs> the Bell family Thanksgiving turkey. Brendan, it's been an honor working with you.